First Amendment. She's a First Amendment person. Oh. She's a First Amendment person. So we'll just right turn here. it over to police. Okay. Okay. Do it. Yep. Where's you? I told right, you we got a First Three, Amendment person two, here. Okay. One. And should be thrown out. Yeah. Guys, so and you're law enforcement. Okay, so you're saying you're going to enforce a rule and not the law today. You're going to wage war on my rights today as I'm a deputy. Gonna, I'm going to go with what the judges say, yeah. What's up, YouTube? Welcome to my channel, where we highlight a few clips of police interactions and police misconduct, with some educational pointers to keep you educated and prepared for your next police encounter. My name is Police Encounters, and my goal is to help educate the public about your rights and how to handle police interactions. As an American citizen, we are given the rights that protect us. And it is the police's duties to protect those rights given to us by the constitution that they swore an oath to. With that being said, the channels we will be covering today are The J-Town Press TTA 42800 Do be sure to check them out in the description below because without them, there's no police encounters. And before we do get into our first video, go ahead and gently smash that like and subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the bell icon to stay notified. It is such a small and easy task for you, but it does help us out tremendously. With all that out the way, let's go ahead and cover our first clip. Wow, look how big this sucker is, huh? They actually have it uh, two different rows. Actually, four different. One, two, three, four, four different rows. And you can actually see they don't really cover your, their information whatsoever. I'm sorry? What am I doing? What, this is the obvious. So. You're not supposed to be recording. Oh, okay. Thank you. So things are Why is that? Why would I do that? Because it says it out there. You're not supposed oh, to be recording. Oh, okay. Thank you. So go ahead. And uh, you have photos over here. There's four different ways, four different uh, rows of, of, of windows. This is a huge DMV. You can see. It's almost like a brand new place here. The employees. I'm guessing this is, uh, oh, it's the photo booth area. You can see that must be the supervisor over there. Hmm. This is brand spanking new. I guess it was just built. That's what it looks like to me. So. Station, so you got one through nine, you got eight, you got five, four. Man, what are you recording? I'm sorry? What are you recording? What am I'm recording you right now. You're not allowed to record in here. Oh, okay. Right in the front. Okay. Yeah. Oh, is this open to the public? It's open to the public, but okay. you're not allowed to record anything. Okay. okay. It says it right in the front. Okay, sounds then good. you're violating the rule. Okay, the rule, not the law. It's the law here. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's not. It says it, it's a statute, and it's the law here. Okay, show it to me. It says it in the front. Come on, so Oh, sure. Yeah. I'm following you. Go on. I'm following you. Ma'am, go on. I, I, how am I going to know where to go if you're not if I'm not following you? you the, the same way you came in. Okay. Okay, go ahead. Okay. Ma'am, no. Ma'am. No, don't touch me. Okay, go ahead. Don't touch me. Go ahead. Ma'am, go on ahead. You can't record. You can't record. Uh, this is open to the public. No, it's not. What are you recording for? Did you I'm recording you right now. Okay. What are you recording for? Let's go. For? Let's go, ma'am. Let's go. Man. Let's go. Yeah. Why are you causing a problem? Uh, you're the one that's causing yeah, a problem. I was on. quiet. <laughs> I was quiet. Let's you're go. the one causing a problem, not me. You're recording. Why are you recording? Quietly. I was quietly recording until you came out. Why, you're not supposed why to are recording. you recording? I'm asking you. Let's go. I don't have to answer your questions. Well, you can't record. Let, let me get the statute. Sure. Go get the statute. Huh? I said, go get the statute. You can't You can't record. Yes, I can. No, you can't. Yes, I can. Either this is my first DMV? <laughs> it says we have everything posted. Uh, okay. As soon as I'm done, I'll leave. You're done. You're leaving. This says restricted access right here. Let's go. Stop causing a disturbance, sir. No, you're causing a disturbance. I didn't say a word to anybody. You can't record in here. One, two, two, three, eight, three. Okay. Yep. You can't record in here. Don't touch me. Yeah. It says it right here. Record that. 
It says, pursuant to Pinellas County, resolution 15-18, Pinellas County. Tax Alpha, record that. I, I'm looking Consider right non-public forums, therefore, use of photography and videography devices pro prohibited. Okay. Written consent? Uh, I you have do. written consent? I have consent. No, you don't. Yes, I do. We're you not consent. Let me see your Let's see the written consent. consent. I don't need to show it to you. Yes, you yes, do. You do. No, I it says here. Yes, you do. You have to give let us written consent. Oh, oh, yeah. written consent. You're causing okay, a disturbance then let's at this go. point. Let let's me see your You're causing consent. disturbance. Go, no, I'm not. Yes, you are. Ma'am, let's go. You don't have written consent. It says okay, you've already said it like 30 times. I heard you. Let's go. Let me see your written consent. We're asking you nicely to leave. Or now we're calling the police. Call the police. Let's go. Don't threaten me. We're not threatening you. You just did. You threatened to call the, the cops with guns. Because you're violating. You're, not you're, you're violating. not doing anything you're supposed to be doing. Exactly. It says it right this here. This is a First Amendment protected activity. No, it says oh, it right here. First Amendment. She's a First Amendment person. Oh. She's a First Amendment person. So we'll just right turn here. it over to police. Okay. Okay. Do it. Yep. Where's Julie? I told All Julie right, I got a First Three, Amendment person two, here. Okay. One. And should be thrown out. Yeah. These are the people our tax dollars yeah. go to pay right here. I pay taxes just as you do. Or if you pay taxes. Because clearly you don't, you don't look like you pay taxes. You're up in here wasting your time. Wow. The negativity. I came in peaceful and yeah, this is the insults and, sl and, the, and the slander. Who why cares? Here, I don't have to tell you. I'm saying that she's doing this for you to get the police in here now, so yeah. they'll take care of her. She wants to be a YouTube fixer. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Like, oh my gosh. Ah. Do it yeah. That's what happens when you don't have a job. Yeah. That's what I just <laughs> The slander. Wow. You come in here violating everybody's rights. Put your cameras instead of being on. How am I violating their rights? With the, can you explain why I'm violating their rights? It clearly states in the front that no, it, no. it's against them. It's against Pinellas County's ordinance. Dash 50 dash 18. You're not supposed to. You don't even have written consent. It says it in the front. So I guess everybody's motives is for money. Yeah, that's you. what your motive is. What are you doing here? What hmm. is your motive? Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> She's a mind reader. Yeah. What's your name and badge number, please? Uh, L. Frest. Frest? Spelling right. What's your badge number? Do you have an ID number? It's 14099. And what's your son? Sorry, Vaughn. Vaughn? Vaughn. And what's your ID number? 33212. Three, and what's your son? Officer Johnston. And what's your badge number? 14955. Thank you. So, I got a call here because sure. uh, I never said a feel word to anybody, and I came in peacefully reporting exercise of a constitutional protected activity. Mm -hmm. On their part, they advised that, I guess, based on your Anywhere recording. I'm only going with the general public allowed. Yes. That's it. Wherever the general public, I'm not going to restricted areas. So may, I tell you, yeah. may I tell you the complaint? Sure. Though? So, their complaint is that due to your recording, it's interrupting their, uh, their operations and all that. I'll give you two case laws that you can actually contact your city attorney. It's called Brandsburg v. Hayes and also Price v. Garland. So the first one actually says that anywhere the public can go, mm -hmm. press can go. And the other one actually says that video recording cannot be uh, uh, expressive, which means they can't call the disturbance. So we're not here to tell you that you're yeah. not allowed to record or anything. Excuse me, yeah. Yeah. yeah, we're not here to tell you that you're not allowed to record or anything like that. The uh, main issue and the main complaint is the camera going over the uh, counter. I never recorded on it. Yeah. Never we just got here. We don't. Okay, yeah. yeah. And if you want to view, review their their footage, and you, I'll be more than happy to show you mine. I never went to restrict it. I never went over. Okay. Any yeah, we, we just got here. Yeah. So. Um, I can show you where I went. Just as long as you understand that you're yeah. not allowed to record other never people's information. Or, yeah. I would never. I don't want to go all over the country right. and do this, and all over Florida for that matter. So they they they, they point out some unconstitutional sign, but it doesn't mean anything. You know that. We know that. Yeah. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. You guys swore an oath to the Constitution. I, I thank you for upholding that. Yeah. Um, 
So the bottom line is, just no selfie sticks, cameras nope. over in your private areas. I mean, I did. I'll, I'll stop like this, but I'm going straight up. And straight up is obviously not over. Mm -hmm. okay. yep. So I can go up as far as I want. Yep. All just the is right. just any areas never, that would be considered like private areas. Yep. Okay. I, I know the law. And if you do that, then I will tell you that we might have to issue your trust password. I understand. Yeah. Okay. No okay. The camera area where they I'll take pictures. I'll, I'll show you here. Hey, can I show you real quick? Yeah, she's gone into the camera areas. She's gone everywhere in the back. She's gone in where they take pictures. She's gone everywhere taking footages. Everywhere. Anywhere. And we already showed her the, the, the Pinellas County. It says that she has to have written consent to videograph her. So if she doesn't have written consent, then we have at certain least. Constitutionally protected. Yes. Okay. Activity that anywhere yeah. the public can go, she's allowed to record. You know, she's going into where the people take pictures and video that. That's what people If you like, we can review whatever footage there may be in the facility, but. Because the, the, the supervisor. Can I take one of y'all? Can you go with me? The supervisor is the one that. I'll tell you what she's talking about. Okay. Yeah, we've already, we've already talked to her as well, so yeah. kind of explain this is a public area. You yeah. can record it. So anywhere the public is allowed to go, if, if she starts reaching behind the counters with the selfie stick, yeah. the computer screens, that's. I was standing right here, and I, I've actually been in each one of these little cubby holes. This is open to the public. I'm not going in any restricted areas. Everywhere you can see that it's clearly identified right here on the, the uh, back door there. Uh, and on this other side over here, you can actually see. Yeah. This is clearly open to the public as well. I mean, yeah. Well, the supervisor didn't like this. Okay. Yeah. Oh, okay, so they have privacy screens. Well, only on ones that are open like this. Uh -huh. The supervisor was the one that did like a protective layer to it. So you can and I appreciate that. And it's, it's up to them to provide the product. Mm -hmm. right. I'm not here for these for, for people, I'm here for these people here. You know I mean and just to do a little story on on the government. You know how it goes. Yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah. And I'm doing my job. I know, I know. So, yeah, we've, we've talked to her and yeah. it explains, you know, anywhere you go through. You know, I don't, yeah, I don't like people hiding behind Amendment 1, Amendment 1. Yeah. Coming and, in, in an establishment. Yeah, and, it, and, it, and, and as soon as she starts, you know, a yeah. selfie stick over well, yeah, I, I, I protected like areas, yeah. that's the problem. Yeah, I don't, I don't like the badges, you know. She, she's crying Amendment 1, Amendment 1, and then and saying that officers are not educated and the negativity and all that stuff. So I don't think it's on my back. Yeah. Come on. It's not. Yeah. I was an officer before. Yeah. I know the rules. So I'm going by my supervisors. Oh, okay. yeah. 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 Yeah.
she just ended up calling the police. And guess what? As you heard, the officers are not there to tell her to stop recording. And the custom officers lied to the officers saying that she was looking over the counters. Yeah, as we saw, she did not do such thing. I'm not sure if you guys heard the officer, but go ahead and go back to timestamp 1033 and just listen. An officer said, and I don't think we've ever heard this from an officer on this channel until today, but he said, it's a constitutionally protected activity that anywhere the public can go, she is allowed to record. This video here is just amazing. These officers were amazing. Respectful of J-Town and her rights. And stood up for the oath that they swore. That right there is the greatest part of this video. Hi, good, so morning. good morning. Hi, I'm Amy Gallino, okay. the Deputy Director of the Department. Okay. What are you I'm just ask this young lady. I think she's helping me. I was just calling her. Yes. Oh, to ask her? Yes. Oh, okay. Yes. Uh, do you want to ask her? <laughs> it doesn't matter. You can. You can ask me. That's okay. Uh, FOIA, you got FOIA request form. I do not have a FOIA request form. What kind of information are you looking for? Uh, just general information. I can document it, uh, write it down, and I'll turn it in to you guys. You want to write something down? Yeah, I'll, do, I'll just do it on a blank sheet. Yeah, that, that should suffice. And you say you're the deputy director here? Oh, yeah. Okay, for sure. My card, sorry, Michelle, I'm getting your way. My card is this one. Okay, great. Yep. If you could leave me your name and number so I can get back to you. Okay, for sure. Well, I'll just give you, I'll give you my number. That should, that should be okay, right? Sure. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I'll just give you my number. Really? Uh, right on the front door. Uh, yeah, I know. I see. I, I yeah. seen that before I came in. Yeah. Yeah. yeah I had seen that. No, I actually read it. Um, only thing. Okay. And Amy, is it? Is it Gala? Gallano. Gallano. I want to make sure I don't butcher it for you. Uh, the only thing about it is, like you said, like you actually said, it's just a policy. So, uh, we're able to still exercise our rights even against you guys' policy. I'm not sure if you're able to. Well, who is we? So I know who I'm calling back. Uh, well, we meaning we the well, people. I need to make a copy of that. Yeah, we the people when I say we. <laughs> and would that be just for this office, though? You guys have a policy or this entire building? I'm not going to make statements for other departments. Oh, okay. Well, I didn't know. I thought it was could have been a, a building policy or just this department policy. I didn't know. All right. Keep going. Okay. That's it. Oh, well, I'm not I'm not done documenting. Okay. <laughs> so I'll once I'm done documenting, then I'll then I'll leave. So, okay. You gonna hang around? Okay. I don't think it's necessary, but I mean, if you if you mean. I'll be right back for you. Okie dokie. It's, 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 it's talking about this policy right here that's attached to the wall of the door. Photography, video, auto recording are restricted within court facilities. Well, we all know that to be false. We all know that to be a false policy, so... Courthouse. Well, I know you can't record in the courtroom. You cannot in the courthouse. Yeah. It's on the door posted. Yeah, I know, but it's it's, it's that's just a that's just a no. that's just a paper that's just something somebody typed up. But I know the judge can't. typed it up. You cannot record. You will have to leave. You well, have to turn off your recording instrument and leave. Well, is there a law attached to it? And according to the judge, he's the law. No, the judge is not the law. The judge he, is just the judge. He is, the, he is in the courthouse. That's correct. 
he, do, he does not make the laws, though, you sir. You can leave, or I can call and have you escorted out. Well, I, I still have official business in the building, sir. You can turn that off if you sir, have. Sir, bring it down a little bit. I'm bringing it down as far as I can. <laughs> well, I mean, I mean, if you if you start getting irate, then I'm going to get irate, and then we're just going to be irate. <laughs> I, I will call Trey Squad. Oh, well, I mean, you got to do what you got to do, but... Uh, like I say, I still have official business in the building, and you, you guys just control. can't infringe on anyone's rights. You just can't do it. Everybody has rights. That's correct. You cannot infringe on their rights. And I, and you can't either, sir. And no, and neither can Amy Gallo here do it as well. So, wow. Like I said it's just a, it's just a, it's just like a courthouse. It's not really. It's not supposed to be the courthouse. It's supposed to be the courtrooms. We all know it's the courtroom. So, did you call the cops? Or are they on the way? Okay. No. Okay. Well, hopefully, they'll educate you guys and let you know that we're not doing anything to break any laws. So the law is being broken right now. As you guys can see, that sign right there also says no cell phone use in this area. See, that's just it. Those are just signs. You know, we all we all know about the law in terms of Illinois courtrooms. We know that, but courthouse, the fair game. Like I said, this is all public record right here. All this is open to the public, so of course we can stand in the lobby and record, or any other public um, building. So, but this young man and. This lady said she's, they called the cops, so I'm going to wait for them to show up and see what they say. Um, hope, wish, and pray that the cops do come to uphold, uphold their oaths today. Uh, if not, GTA family, y'all already know what I'm going to do. Multiple complaints to the highest degree. No. How you doing, deputy? Um, if you can if you can inform these I young fine folks times. that uh, what I'm doing is exercising my right in public today, I have official business in the building today, okay. and I have already conveyed to him and her that once I'm done conducting my official business, I will leave. But you can't record because it's posted all over. You can't record in this building. Yeah. Well, I know that the law, Illinois state law, said you can't record inside of courtrooms. So I'm very aware of that, making sure to make no efforts to even go inside of a courtroom. Just want to be able to access the publicly accessible areas, um, just like I've been doing the entire time that I'm here. Yeah. I know that's that's what I'm Within saying. Court facilities. This is a court facility, okay? The, I said the judges that. made these laws. Yeah, the not the, I'm sorry. Right, because the they can't make this laws. Rule, this this rule. Okay, okay, I understand, but we're talking about in terms of the law itself. The law itself okay. states that I well, can record public officials the circuit, the circuit in the course of their duties. Of this district, okay. Otherwise, we have to enforce that. So you guys, so in your law enforcement. Yes. Okay, so you're saying you're going to enforce a rule and not the law today. You're going to wage war on my rights today. As I'm a deputy, gonna, I'm going to go with what the judges say. Yeah. So you are going to okay. So you're saying you are going to enforce the rule instead of law, and you're saying that on camera comfortably. Yeah. Okay. So you're going to wage war on my right then today too as well. Well, you, you need to either turn that off or leave. Well, I have official business, so you're saying well, I can't conduct my, I can't conduct my business. You can conduct. What's your name and badge number, sir? It's Sergeant Krieger. Seven. Sergeant Krieger, you work for the Boone County Sheriff's Department. But okay. You just read that, right? Yeah, I, I just read that, which is not a law. So are you it's a rule. Yeah, but it's not a law. I only follow laws. I only have to follow laws. No, you need to follow rules too. Well, I'm in a publicly accessible area, sir, not doing anything to go, you know, making any efforts to go past any courtrooms. And the, and the, and the, and if you're familiar with ACLU versus Alvarez, which is a state law, case law stating that I can record public officials in the course of their duties, are you going to step on that today, sir? Because it's going to come down on you personally. I'm just trying to tell you you got to follow the rules. Right? I understand what you're saying, but do you understand where I'm coming from as a citizen? What and times your, your, what, do you have a time they have to be up to court? Or you no, I don't, I don't have to be at court at all today. Oh. I just want to file a couple of FOIA requests and book on out. That's it. Okay. That's all I want to do. Okay. 
Well, then go ahead and do that. Um, that's exactly precisely what I was trying to do, sir, before they called the laws trying to infringe on my rights today. I, so well, I would definitely, well, I appreciate that. <clears throat> so we'll go back in here and file additional FOIA with the probation office, and then uh, we'll leave for the day. Um, huh? What did you say? Were you getting ready to say something? Nope. Oh, okay. Well, I need to file another for you, and then, uh, and then um, I'll be good to go. That'll be it for me. And they've locked the door, obviously. That's to keep us out, but like I said, we're not doing any, making any efforts to go and pass any type of any type of restricted areas. Just want to file another for you. You have to turn that off in this department. Man, we just, uh, how you doing, sir? Are you like a supervisor? Nope. I am oh. a supervisor. Oh, you're over everyone? In this department. You cannot uh, be in this that's department. That's unfortunate. You turn off your video. Well, you just seen that the deputy told me that I'm good to go. You need to leave the building. The deputy just told me. And turn off the video. The, the deputy that you guys called for help. <laughs> he said to turn off the video. Absolutely not. He told me to keep okay. keep proceeding to do what I have to do. Oh, I have to file a for you. Are you going to refuse that? You can't have the video on in this department. It's the policy. It's department. just yes or no. If you say yes, you're going to refuse it's me a the FOIA, then I'll leave. Department, you cannot have the video on. Okay, so I can't file my FOIA. You cannot have a video on in this department as part of the rules. So you're going to infringe on my rights to file a FOIA, which is going to be violating state law. Okay, this is Amy Gallo. This is Amy Gallo who won't allow us to file a FOIA even after the deputy obviously said go ahead and do that so we just file another complaint on her which we was able to file the first the first for you so we were successful with the first one uh, she gave us a xerox copy she don't want us to file an additional for you uh sheriff Cry is it krieger 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 well okay i just just to let you know what happened real quick i went back there to file my for you and she wouldn't allow me to shut the door and locked it on me so uh but i'm just saying i just want to be able to let you know that so i will be filing um uh, numerous of complaints, especially on this guy too here. Are, are you a sheriff? Yes. Oh, you are a sheriff. You work for the sheriff's department, or are you just yes. security for sheriff? Yes. Which one? I work for the sheriff's department. Okay. So the sheriff's department is the one who employs you. Yes. Okay. Okay. Well, because oh, so so you have a badge number too as well, sir. Yes. Okay. Can I have it? Seventy-seven fifty-two. Seventy-seven. Seventy-seven fifty-seven. And your and your what's your name? Mosque. Mosque, okay. So uh, where's you guys' uh, sheriff's department located so we can go hike over and... Straight across here, if you go out to your right, okay. if you follow this sidewalk, you'll see a uh, red awning that says public safety building. Public safety right building. There. Okay, appreciate that. So we'll just hike on over to the sheriff's department and file some complaints, man, on that first guy there. Uh, Amy's definitely going to get it, you know. My thing was... Uh, my, my whole thing was, real quick, TTA family is the sheriff coming in trying to enforce a judge's rule. We ain't going to stand for that. The rules do not supersede the law. That's why he, he eventually said, well, just go ahead. You know, they'll try you. They're going to try you, man, but you got to just stand firm. <coughs> and um, we was able to do that today. Uh, the lady wouldn't let us file an additional for you. So we, we, we definitely going to put something in on her. But we're going to go over here and file a complaint on that first sheriff. For even you know uh, calling the another sheriff, which was, I guess he had to, you know. But we we'll just go over here and file us and file us some complaints, man. And we'll go from there. So uh, y'all stay tuned. TTA walks in and is trying to request a FOIA. Goes well until the deputy director tells him he can't film inside the building. She then points out where the sign is to telling him so. But guess what? He already saw it. And again, a policy cannot trump the Constitution. Why is it so hard for public servants to understand that? The deputy director then walks up to the so-called security officer and says he has to turn the video off because he can't record in the courthouse. Well, sir, you can record in the courthouse, you just can't record inside the courtroom. There's a difference. So what does the so-called security officer do? You got that right. Calls the authorities. As we see, this officer is nothing like the others we saw in the first video. This one here does not care for people's rights. 
But the officer somehow managed to change his mind and let him do his business. Amy and TTA then walk towards the room again. And just a few seconds as they walk in the room, she tells him she can't record again. Even after the sergeant told her and told him that it was okay to do his business. Just look at the difference in these two videos. The first one is how officers should be. The second is how they definitely should not be. That's going to be it for today's video. If you have a video you'd like us to review, please leave a message in the comments. If you'd enjoyed this video, hit the like and subscribe button. If you didn't, hit the dislike button. Be sure to check out the channels we watched today out. And give them a subscribe. Thank you for watching. Until next time, on Police Encounters.